campaign 2020, President Trump says he will show up for Thursday night's second and final presidential debate. But he's not happy about the changes the debate commission made. Natalie Brand has more details from the White House. You didn't think I should have closed our country? Wait a minute. The mute button is coming to the next presidential debate. The New question Supreme is, Justice, the radical question, left, will you shut who is up, man? Listen. Organizers announced new rules that give President Trump and Joe Biden two uninterrupted minutes to answer questions at the start of each segment. During that time, the other candidate's microphone will be off. These people are not good people, this commission. A uh, lot of funny things go on with them. President Trump says the Commission on Presidential Debates is against him and repeated a claim he made yesterday about Thursday's debate moderator. Kristen Welker is, you know, a guide in the wall, radical left Democrat or whatever she is. Okay. Okay, then ask, why are you defending her? The president says he's also unhappy. The night will include topics beyond the debate's original focus, foreign policy. But he says he still plans on attacking Biden over his son Hunter's business deals in Ukraine and China. I think he's imploding. You look at all the corruption in his family. It's tremendous corruption. The Biden campaign, for its part, said President Trump is, quote, afraid to face more questions about his disastrous COVID response and is more concerned with the rules of the debate than he is getting a nation in crisis the help it needs. He was informed that it was lethal in proportion. It would kill five times as many people as the flu. He was informed. And what did he do? He stood at rallies and he stood before the American people and he didn't tell you what he knew. Aside from the debate, Biden does not have any public appearances scheduled until Friday. The candidates have just two weeks until Election Day. Natalie Brand, CBS News, the White House.